So I mainly see patients who have lung cancer and basically this population definitely includes patients that have smoking exposure. But what we're seeing lately is a trend in younger patients that develop uh, lung cancer who are non-smokers. And in those patients particularly, we're seeing specific genetic mutations that drive the cancer. What drives me is care of the patient. Uh, I think uh, being in medicine is usually because you have that passion, you want to take care of uh, patients. And in cancer specifically, the challenges that these patients face pushes me to do more, and that's what pushes me to do research, not just taking care of the patient uh, needs now, hoping that I can figure out something that can eventually make a big difference. And nowadays, there are a lot of options. We have a lot of standard of care treatments, and there is a lot of clinical trials that are available for patients. So there are a lot of options, and that's usually what makes them feel better. At the end of the day, the smile of the patient, the, their feeling that there's somebody that really cares about them. That's something that we frequently see. A lot of patients that come for a second opinion or were seen outside will say, in this hour I know about my disease more than the past three months or six months. So that's very uh, rewarding. That's what keeps me going, just the appreciation that we are making a difference.